A very good morning to all. Today we are moving on to the next chapter in science which is about plants around us. So we live in a very beautiful world. Around us we can see different kinds of plants. So is plant a living thing or a non-living thing? Plants are living things because they need air, water and food to live. So there are different kinds of plants around us. So today we will discuss about the different kinds of plants. So the first one is big plants. You know what are big plants? Plants which are big and strong we call them as big plants and some are tall. Trees are big plants. You can see many trees around you. So trees are big plants. They are big and strong and they have a thick stem. Let's see an example. So this is an apple tree. Apple tree is a big plant. So trees have thick stem. This is the stem of a tree. Trees have thick stem. You know which plant is this? This is a mango tree. This is a mango plant. And mango tree is a big plant. It is big and strong. So there are many other trees which you can see around you. Coconut tree. Coconut tree is a tall tree. It is a big plant. Do you know which is the tallest growing tree in the world? It is the coarse redwood tree. So what are big plants? Plants which are big and strong are big plants. And trees are big plants. Okay, now let's see about small plants. What are small plants? Plants which are smaller than trees. The plants which grow short. They are not tall as a tree. We call them as small plants. There are many plants which is around us smaller. Spinach. Do you know spinach? Spinach is a leafy vegetable and spinach plant is a small plant. It grows short. Next one, grass. The grass around us, the grass we see around us is a small plant. It grows short. You know which plant is this? This is hibiscus. Hibiscus is also an example for small plant. So we learned about big plant and small plant. Big plants are trees. They are big and strong. What about small plants? Small plants are smaller than trees. They grow short. You can name two big plant and small plant in your surrounding. So you can look around your surrounding and you can see different kinds of plants around you. From that you can name two big plant and two small plant. So where have to write? You can write down in your notebook. Okay. Moving on to the next kind of plant, that is creeper. Have you heard about the word creeper? Creepers are also kinds of plants which grow along the ground. There are some plants which cannot stand straight, like trees. Trees can grow straight and they grow, but there are plants which can't grow straight. So such plants grow along the ground. They are called creepers. Have you seen pumpkin? Pumpkin is a creeper because it grows along the ground. Another example for a creeper is watermelon. Watermelon is a creeper. It grows along the ground. Next, we will see the next kind of plant is climbers. Have you heard of the word climbers? Climbers means climbing. So these are plants which climb with a support. So these plants also cannot stand straight on its own, cannot grow on its own. So these plants grow, they climb with the support of other plants or with the support of a wall or with the support of a stick. So they climb with a support. Such plants are called as climbers. You know any example for climbers? Let's see. Grapevine. It is an example of climbing plant. They climb with the support. 
another example pea plant it is an also it is also an example for a climbing plant because it climbs with a support so what did we learn today we learned about four kinds of plants big plant small plant climbers and creepers so what are big plants trees are big plants they are big and strong then what about small plants plants which are smaller than trees we call them as small plants what about creepers plants which grow along the ground we call them as creepers then what are climbers plants which climb the word itself says climbing so the plants which climb with a support we call them as climbers so these are the different kinds of plants so an activity for you is you can name any two creeper and climber and write it down in your notebook so what is your activity you have to find two big plant and small plant and two creepers and two climbers then you can write it down in your notebook so that's all for today we'll meet in the next class with a new topic till then thank you